you know, the Davenport Community Schools focus on student achievement. We have high expectations for all students and challenging courses at every level. Now, when we run this electrophoresis, we're running negative to positive, but why does the DNA move through the gel? Because it's a polar molecule. We're very committed, maybe more so than I've seen in other locations, very committed to student achievement through improved instruction. Afterwards, he crossed it out. You even knew that, didn't you? Children's Village is our premier early learning center. It's a huge success. I see us as an innovator for the state of Iowa. It's everything that you read about in all these early childhood manuals and all these classes that you take, and you always wonder, does it really exist? And it does, right here in Davenport, Iowa. Davenport, I think, is a forward-thinking community. The classroom is becoming, a, I think, a more exciting place because of technology. I try to make my classes interesting. I love teaching history because it, I, I always tell them it's a life skill. You learn from everyone. We're not only just teaching children the, the reading, the writing, and the arithmetic, but through those um, content areas, we're also trying to teach them to think critically, to um, be able to problem solve, those types of things. And it's really neat to you know, come into the classroom and see the kids working in groups and getting along and trying to solve a problem together. You know, I was in the grocery store a couple weeks ago and a little girl who hated reading came up to me and told me she loves reading now. Thank you, Ms. Ivory, for making me read. I just love it. It's going to recognize the density of this object. You're going to be able to calculate the weight. We just got national certification, um, the schools in Davenport, for Project Lead the Way. It's a nationally renowned um, pre-engineering program. Students who complete the sixth course, course of study um, will earn college credit at Iowa and Illinois State Universities in their engineering programs. So it's really a leg up for the students uh, that we offer here in Davenport to get them prepared to walk into those colleges and move on to the next stage of their life. Right click again. What you're doing is saying, I'm done sketching. Did you know the Davenport Community Schools has invested over $100 million during the past six years in improving our buildings? Well, I think the Quad Cities is a, um, a really nice balance in between being in a very small town and being in one of the really major cities. Uh, we really kind of have the best of both worlds without being so huge that you're in your car all the time. Employment opportunities are good here. Um, we're not too far from Chicago, or we're kind of really in the middle of Chicago, Omaha, St. Louis, and the Twin Cities. Did you know Davenport Community Schools is one of the largest school districts in the state of Iowa? We have over 16,000 students in four communities. Davenport Community Schools has great teachers. Every day. 
friends with the guy who gives you the eye and let them hold you tight. We have great opportunities uh, for our students. There are, uh, there's something for everyone. God save the people. Oh, God save the people. When will thou save the people? Grew up in Davenport and then moved off to the big city, lived in Chicago, and started a family. That's when we started to think about uh, relocating back to Davenport. We wanted our children to come back and go to school where we did. We knew that, that it's possible for students here to get a really good education and partake in some of the, the, the traditional um, culture that's in the Davenport schools. The performing arts, for example, is, has always been outstanding. Did you know Davenport Community Schools offers a wide range of advanced placement courses? It's just a really, really tight-knit community. In a very big urban school, I think that that speaks volumes as to a connection that the, the school community has with the parents and the students. I moved to Milwaukee and I was raising my uh, two sons. Diversity wasn't there. The class size was very large. When I brought them back here, I was able, they were able to go to their teachers and, and get uh, help with their homework. Students in Davenport, okay. they have an opportunity to, to grow and to learn, and they get all the benefits that go along with learning and growing in a diverse population. It's so real world, and I, you can't get that, I don't think, in some of the surrounding districts. It's a good preparation for real life out in the world, whether it's uh, going on to college or to a trade school or, or whatever people are going to do when they get out of, out of school. We're very, very happy to have our kids going to school um, here in Davenport. It's really quite remarkable what they've done. Yeah! <laughs>